A delegation of European Green Party officials is visiting Taiwan. It was received by President Tsai Ing-wen at the presidential office on Monday. The visit comes after Vice President-elect Xiaobi Kim met key political figures in Europe. The foreign ministry confirms that during her low-key visit, Xiao stopped by the European Parliament and met with prominent MEPs. President Tsai Ing-wen received a delegation from the European Green Party, which is visiting Taiwan for the first time. Tsai thanked her guests for supporting Taiwan with concrete action. I want to express my gratitude to the European Parliament and to each one of you for your concrete actions affirming Taiwan's democracy and freedom and for continuing to strengthen support for Taiwan. I also want to take this opportunity to thank the European Green Party for backing Taiwan's international participation. I think under your wise leadership over the last years, Taiwan has won many, many additional trends around Europe. If you look at the European Parliament, we have charted a course of strong, cohesive solidarity. All the five major political groups that often disagree on almost everything do agree on our support for Taiwan. The delegation said one reason for its visit was to learn from Taiwan's experience in countering authoritarianism. In the face of a growing wave of authoritarianism and Taiwan and us share democratic values, share human rights values, share the value of rule of law. And on that basis, we build our solidarity. I believe that your visit will facilitate deeper exchanges between Taiwan and Germany as well as other EU countries on issues of mutual concern. I also anticipate even closer bilateral cooperation on counter-disinformation, supply chain security and economic and trade exchanges. Amid warming Taiwan-Europe relations, Vice President-elect Xiaobi Kim began a low-key visit in Europe in mid-March. Besides meeting important political figures from several countries, Xiao was invited to visit the European Parliament, where she was received by First Vice President Otmar Karas and more than 30 MEPs. We look forward to her return because we started a live stream show and we're under a lot of pressure to get viewers. We need Xiao to come on the show and boost viewership. There are reports that Xiao has already finished her European tour and returned to Taiwan. However, neither the Ministry of Foreign Affairs nor the DPP has given a confirmation. DPP spokesperson Justin Wu made a humorous call for Xiao's swift return, saying he needs her back to promote his show.